evolution of Boston Dynamics' newest products. Boston Dynamics makes some of the most badass robots beast around. Launched in 1992 as a spin-off from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, the company has created some remarkably sophisticated machines, especially when it comes to replicating animal movements. It took more than a decade for the company's first robots to emerge from its lab, but since then, Boston Dynamics has positioned itself as a leader in the field, unveiling robots that can sprint faster than Usain Bolt, leap onto buildings, and backflip better than most humans. But it's well known that creations are its canine-inspired robots. In today's video, we'll bring you evolutionary milestones made by Boston Dynamics, from its first iteration of Big Dog to the commercialization of Spot Mini, so don't forget to watch this video to the very end. But before we begin, we request you to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to never miss another upload of ours. Having said that, let's jump right in. January 2009, Big Dog make its debut. Boston Dynamics first hit the scene in 2005 with the introduction of a 3 foot long, 2.5 foot wide, 240 pound robot named Big Dog. Funded by the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, which specializes in high risk, high yield investments, Big Dog was designed to be a pack mule for soldiers, capable of carrying 340 pounds, climbing 35 degree inclines, and no doubt striking fear into the hearts of opposition. February of 2009. Little Dog crawls into the spotlight. If Big Dog was the size of a beefy Great Dane, Little Dog was unveiled as a scrappy Chihuahua. Also funded by DARPA, Little Dog represented the smallest four-legged robot in the Boston Dynamics product line. Powered by lithium polymer batteries, Little Dog had a 30-minute operation limit, could be controlled remotely, and was capable of crawling, albeit slowly, across rocky terrain. Whereas Big Dog was built by Boston Dynamics for Boston Dynamics, Little Dog was developed as a test bed for use by third parties. September 2011, Alpha Dog Proto introduced. When Alpha Dog Proto came onto the scene in 2011, Boston Dynamics' military aspirations became ever more transparent. Thanks to funding from DARPA and the United States Marine Corps, Alpha Dog Proto was capable of varying a 400 pound payload during a 20 mile mission through varied terrain. An internal combustion engine served to quiet the noisier Big Dog, which came with a rather loud rumble, making it more appropriate for missions in the field. September 2012. Legged Squad Support System arrives. The next evolution of Alpha Dog Proto was the Legged Squad Support System, LS3, which proved more versatile and robust than its predecessor. An array of sensors along the LS3 let it follow its human leader, while simultaneously navigating rough terrain to avoid obstacles. If tipped over, the robot could roll itself upright. February 2013. Big Dog takes on objects. Big Dog returned with a new trick in 2013, arguably its most intimidating to date. This time, equipped with an arm, the robot could pick up a 35-pound cinder block and vigorously toss it up to 17 feet behind it. To do so, Big Dog was trained to use its legs and torso as leverage, gripping and slinging the rock like a drunken Olympian throwing discus. February 2015, Spot. In 2015, Boston Dynamics unveiled its latest creation, an electrically powered, hydraulically actuated robot named Spot. At just 160 pounds, Spot was significantly smaller than previous canine-inspired models, and was designed for both indoor and outdoor activities. Sensors in its head allowed it to navigate rocky terrain and avoid obstacles in transit. Spot could capably climb stairs and ascend hills, making it more versatile than its beefier forebears. June 2016, Spot Mini bounds into the spotlight. We got a glimpse of Spot's little brother, Spot Mini, in 2016. Weighing in at 55 pounds, Spot Mini was by far the smallest and most mischievous Boston Dynamics robot yet. Promoted as an all-electric, meaning there were no hydraulics involved, Spot Mini boasted 90 minutes of operation on a single charge, a slew of sensors that gave the robot advanced navigation capabilities, and the ability to perform some basic tasks autonomously. Spot Mini sported an optional arm and gripper that let it pick up fragile objects and right itself after slipping on a banana peel. November 2017, Spot Mini gets a makeover. In November of 2017, Boston Dynamics introduced the new and improved Spot Mini, a yellow robot whose fluid movements showed significant improvement over the more jerky prototype. But it wasn't until a few months later that the robot's robustness was demonstrated in a series of videos showing the machine pulling a door open, deftly putting its leg in front, and even working against one of the many Boston Dynamics engineers who seemed hellbent on breaking its stride. May 2018. Spot Mini explores autonomously. 
A video posted by Boston Dynamics in May of 2018 shows just how far its Spot Mini has come. Equipped with a sophisticated navigation system, the robot is able to autonomously navigate through the company's offices and lab, following a path that it had previously mapped out during a manually driven run. This video was soon followed by news that after nearly three decades, Boston Dynamics will make the Spot Mini commercially available in 2019. September 2019, Boston Dynamics shows off Atlas robots doing parkour. Boston Dynamics' humanoid robot, known as Atlas, showed off its impressive parkour capabilities in a new video the robotics company posted to YouTube on Tuesday, coinciding with the commercial launch of their dog-like robot, Spot. In the video, the Atlas robot shows off in a gymnastic routine, complete with somersaults, handstands, jumps, and turns. Boston Dynamics said in the video's description that a new algorithm was used that tracks the robot's motion and predicts its next maneuvers. The company said that with the latest technological approach, the Atlas had a performance success rate of about 80%. Atlas has come a long way since 2017 when it fell off a stage during a presentation at the Congress of Future Science and Technology Leaders. Atlas can already move with ease across a range of terrains using its built-in LiDAR and stereo sensors and even get back up by itself if it falls down, so it appears to be heading towards an endless range of applications. The humanoid robot has hydraulic 28 joints that allow for this impressive mobility and lightweight 3D printed parts that allow it to weigh only 80 kilograms, 176 pounds. It's one of four robots that the Massachusetts-based team is perfecting. One of its most well-known robots, Spot, is finally available for purchase. Only companies can apply to buy Spot right now, which means that you can't purchase your own pet Spot for your home. Boston Dynamics said that the robot could be used to monitor construction sites, remotely inspect gas or power installations, and be used for public safety. February of 2020, Boston Dynamics' remarkable robot dog, Lance Gig. Boston Dynamics' remarkable robot dog has landed its first gig, taking on a myriad of tasks on oil and gas production vessel in Norway. Spot, as the RoboDog is called, has been in development for years, with numerous iterations culminating in a design that's agile as it's clever. In September of 2019, the Massachusetts-based team that created Spot announced its readiness for commercial deployment, with Norwegian oil producer Acre BP apparently the first to show an interest. Acre BP is keen to see how well Spot can carry out a range of tasks that will include running inspections, sniffing out gas leaks, gathering data, and generating reports. The trial will also gauge Spot's ability to perform tasks considered dangerous for humans, and its effectiveness at providing onshore operators with telepresence on offshore installations. March 2020. Handle Robot gets an autonomous coworker. The idea of robots successfully collaborating might ordinarily send a shiver down your spine, but in the case of Boston Dynamics' Handle Robot, there appears to be very little to worry about. The talented engineers behind the likes of Atlas and Spot have also been working diligently on Handle, a highly versatile wheel-based robot designed for handling boxes weighing up to 33 pounds, 15 kilograms, whether in a warehouse on for loading and unloading trucks and shipping containers. A video released in 2020 showed the autonomous robot strutting its stuff, selecting boxes using deep learning vision software, picking them up using a suction cup at the end of an extendable arm, and stacking them neatly on a stationary pallet. It was all very impressive. Now though, Massachusetts-based Boston Dynamics had partnered with Auto Motors, a specialist in industrial mobile robots, for a demonstration designed to show the future of warehouse automation, where autonomous robots work with each other to perform multiple tasks. With that, we end today's video. If you enjoyed our content, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Lastly, join in next time for more of such interesting content.